Hello, welcome back to my channel. It's Jacola Mari, and basically I just wanna do a quick video on my starter lock. So I decided to start my locks again. Um, what's today? Today is the 25th, I believe, June 25th, yeah. And so I just decided that I wanted to, I've been contemplating for like the longest to go back to locks. And I used to have locks and I might insert some pictures in the video um, for you all if you are a new subscriber or if you're new to my channel, whatever, however you wanna say it. But um, yeah, so I got my locks done. I think my appointment today was at 8.30 and I left like around, I don't remember, but it was a few hours in the chair. Um, but yeah, so I decided to do two strand twists. Yeah, and this is how so I didn't looking. want to do comb coils this time because last time I did comb coils, and comb coils like tend to like draw up like. And I'm sorry, excuse me, I look busted right now because I've been cleaning today and I was like I can clean my bathroom and all that, and then I was out running around and anywho. But this is how I'm looking. Um, the only thing about this, I love my hair. They were wrong. But you know what, anything new, it's gonna be flat. And you know, you gotta like, you know, manipulate it and you know, just like, you know, make it your own. Um, my stylist, she does put like lock jewelry on, um, hair jewelry, lock jewelry, however you wanna say it, on your locks. And I think I have some more there, another one. And yep, I'm just excited for the journey. Um, I just can't wait to see how they look in like the next week, two, uh, two, three weeks, a month, two months. Um, I know my hair will probably lock fast because I have that 4C hair, more like 4Z hair, but I don't care. Um, I want locks. Locks are like the best, in my opinion, the best protective style, however you want to say it. Cause yeah, you can always comb it out, but um, I don't plan on ever combing my hair out again. So I want to go back to locks and this is where I am and this is where I'm going to stay. Possibly, I'm trying to, just keep locks for the rest of my life, whatever. But you know, your mind may change, what have you. Um, but yeah, I will say this: I do have like breakage in the back of my hair, so it's like, um, and in the front, like so you can see like my edges. This is like from the first time I had locks. Now I won't say I don't think it was the locks that caused the breakage. I think it was me like over styling, over manipulating it. Like I used to wear like a lot of updos. I used to do a lot of pipe cleaners and the tool or the the thing that you use to do pipe cleaners, they're sharp at the end so they would snag my hair. So I'm pretty sure that probably contributed to my loss of my hair. This side is not too bad, but it, it was some thinnage over here. But so she started, she did some coils and hopefully it grows in. I'm, I've been dealing with this for some time. And basically I had to go to a dermatologist, get shots and steroid shots and stuff, but they really didn't work. So I have some breakage around my perimeter and then I have some breakage like in the back. So most of my back is like in comb coils and I might just turn around so you can probably see it. Hopefully you can see it. It's like right here. So she did a little bit um, of, she did some comb coils in the back. So I hope that they lock up nicely, but yep, this is how it's looking. This is the first day. So I'm trying to, the last, the last time I had locks, I didn't document anything really. I just took a lot of pictures, of course, but like I didn't document, you know, the different stages, you know, so this is the beginning and no, we will not be calling this the ugly phase because it is not the ugly phase. It's your starter phase, you know. Um, I guess it's your blossoming phase or however you want to say it. Um, it's just a new phase. So I I love when my hair gets older. So I can't wait to see as it gets older. Right now, it's just so fresh and so clean. And the parts, the parts are just so defined. Like, do you see this? Like my scalp looks so clean, like you can eat off of it or something. You know what I'm saying? I mean, don't do that, but you know, it just looks so clean, like. So I just can't wait to see the journey. I'm gonna make sure that I keep, this time make sure my uh, journey is simple. Last time I was putting everything in my hair. I was putting honey, I was putting beeswax and gel. Now to each his own, let me just let me just say that. To each his own, if you wanna use gel, if you wanna use honey, beeswax, that's on you. But I just, 
it damaged my hair. So I'm just talking from my experience. When I had locks, it damaged my hair badly. And, um, you know, I had, like I said, breakage. But what I'm gonna try to do this time, I might just wear my hair in more curls this time as opposed to like styles, even though like, I love updos. Um, I used to do like the, they call it the basket weave. Um, and just braided my hair and all that stuff. But over manipulation causes breakage. So, you know, what can I, you know, it's not a surprise that my hair broke. Thankfully, it didn't break so bad, but it broke. And of course, the edges are a little bit more fragile than the rest of your hair, so, you know. So I just can't wait to see the journey, and I just can't wait to, you know, go through the different phases, because I don't feel like, when I first had my first set of locks, I was actually in middle school. So like, that was already an awkward phase already, because back then, when I was in middle school, natural hair wasn't like, a thing everybody wanted their hair straightened or blowed out or like just you know they just wanted it straight and so like you know it was an awkward phase for me and I felt you know I felt ugly sometimes and I was just like oh my goodness like when is my hair gonna like grow or drop or whatever and you know by the time I got to let me see yeah by the time I got to high school it you know it dropped towards the end of my middle school years but by the time I got to high school you couldn't tell me nothing. And then I ended up coloring the ends of my hair and I was like, oh, I thought I was, I thought I was doing something. But um, but then the color messed up my hair and how to cut it out. I'm like, I just, I just wanna be educated on how to take care of my hair this time. Cause last time it was just a, it was a no, it was a no. But I wanted to do a different technique cause I did comb coils last time. And I just, when they, when they get older, it's almost like a fro and then like the little coil, like coils at the end. So I think two strand tip twist keeps your hair a little bit more like, how can I say it? Um, precise, however you want to say it. Like, uh, I think it keeps your, like, your parts more defined, if you would say. That's the perfect, that's the perfect word, defined. So like, I know my parts, if I keep my two strand twists all the way up to my next appointment, whatever, my parts are gonna still be there. That's the thing, when you first start your locks, you wanna make sure your parts are still defined and you know visible because as they mature, they're gonna grow into however you have them. So if you just, you know, if you want more freeform, do freeform, but I want a more, I guess, traditional and I want defined parts and that's just, you know me. But I like how, I'm not sure, oh, I guess she did. See, I thought she was doing circle parts, but I don't know, I guess they look more square-ish. I can't really tell, they look more square-ish. But anywho, that's fine. But yeah, I love them. Um, and this is a another coil. I had like some breakage here too. I don't know, it's just, I have breakage in like weird areas, but thankfully I don't have any breakage like in the middle and like, it's just like small areas, like a little bit in the front, a little bit in the back. I'm cool with that. I think over time it'll grow back, hopefully. It will grow back um because it's been like that for some time now so but yeah i just wanted to come in and show you and really i'm just making a video because i want to document you know um my life journey so i gotta keep a you know some videos to see because i you know you just want to see how your hair has changed i love to see that's the one thing i love about locks is that it goes into phases so your hair is not gonna look like how it looked like from day one to day 30 or day 60 or you know, 100 or whatever. It's not gonna look the same. So, um, yeah. So yeah, but here's the front and here's the back. And I don't know if you see the middle. Yeah, so, yeah. But yeah, I just wanted to show y'all my hair and for anybody who is contemplating on getting locks or who, who you're nervous, you're scared, I'm gonna say this. If you want to get them, get them. If you're in between, you know, weigh out the pros and cons of locks versus loose. But I'm going to tell you, most of the styles that I did when I was loose, um, I can do with my lock pair. So you can still curl it, um, you know, pin it up, wear buns, um, anything. You know, I know, I think I've seen some people like straighten their locks with it. Uh, the flat iron, I mean, I wouldn't do it for me personally, but I've seen that too. So you can literally do just about anything. It's not like it's like a, oh, I can't do anything. I just have locks. Like locks are very versatile. It's very 
versatile. It's a versatile style and it's a protective style. So yes, if you wanted to comb them out, you can comb them out. But, um, or you can just cut them off. But it's not like the end all, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, if I get locks, I can't do this and that. And some people even put braids over their locks. Now me, as for me, I, I don't think I would do that because I feel like the weight, like I already have, I already have like kind of damaged areas. So I don't want to add more to it. So um, yeah, it's just like, you know, that is where I am with my hair. So, oop, and I took out one of the, the uh, pieces of jewelry, but so, thank you yeah. for uh, tuning in to Chicola Mari and I will be back with another video in, I don't know how long, but soon. Just so I can show y'all an update of my hair. So y'all all have a good one. Take care. Bye.